Do you know that the Play Store on your phone has settings that track what you do on your phone, like which apps you use and what you do in them, then send this information to developers. Some people worry about this, while others don't. However, this setting uses RAM memory, which is why your phone slows down and drains the battery faster. In today's video, I'll show you how to find and disable them. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and let's dive in. To find first setting, open Play Store. Then, in the upper right hand corner of the screen, tap on your profile photo. Scroll down a little bit and tap on Play Protect. After this, in the upper right hand corner of the screen, tap on Gear icon. Here we see two features – Scan apps with Play Protect and Improve Harmful App Detection. First feature – Scan apps with Play Protect scans our phone to find malicious applications and inform us about them. This is very helpful and useful feature, so it should be enabled. To know which applications are dangerous and should be removed from our phone. If you have it disabled, make sure to enable it. But the second feature – Improve Harmful App Detection. Collect information about which applications we use on our phone and send this data to developers, so I recommend turn this off. To find the next feature that tracks what you do in applications on our phone, you should first update the Play Store, because this feature appeared recently after a Play Store update. To find it and disable it now, we need to manually update the Play Store, since it will automatically update itself sooner or later, and this feature will appear. So, open Play Store. After this, in the upper right hand corner of the screen, tap on your profile photo. Then tap on Settings, after this tap About, and here you can update your Play Store. Tap on Update Play Store. I have Google Play Store is up to date. After this scroll all the way up and tap on General. Scroll down a little bit. And here we can see App Install Optimization. This feature sends information to developers about what we do in our applications on the phone. Since this feature runs in the background, it slows down our phone and drains its battery faster, so I recommend turning this off. Next, I'll show you the settings in the Play Store that you should change so your phone works much longer on the single charge. Open Play Store. After this, in the upper right hand corner of the screen, tap on your profile photo. Then scroll all the way down and tap on, on Help as feedback. Then in search type Delete. Just uh, type uh, word Delete. And here you can find Delete apps on your Android device. Tap on that. After this, tap on Tap to go to application settings. Here we see a list of applications installed on your phone. First, let's sort them by how often we use them. Tap here. After this, in the section Sort by, choose Last Used and tap OK. And now let's click on any application at the top of this list. For instance, let's click on Chrome. After this, scroll all the way down and tap on Battery. And here we see whether this application is optimized on our phone or not. If unrestricted is selected, it means that app consumes a lot of battery and reduces operating phone time without recharging. For most apps, I recommend selecting optimized, so they don't quickly drain the battery. After this, in the upper left hand corner of the screen, tap back, tap back again. And check which apps in this list are not optimized yet, and optimize uh, them as we just did. And the last setting I want to show you is a bonus. It's not in the Play Store, it's in the main settings, and allows developers to monitor everything we do on our phone and send this information via the internet. For example, it tracks how often we charge our phone, when we use it, what features we use, and so on. This feature also runs in the background, which can slow down your phone because more RAM is used and battery drains faster. Plus, since data is sent over the internet, it uses up your data too. So, head to main settings. After this, scroll down to security and privacy and tap on that. Then, 
scroll all the way down and tap on more privacy settings. And here you can see send diagnostic data. Uh, turn off uh, the switch next to send diagnostic data. After this tap here and tap OK. That's all I wanted to share with you in today's video. If you liked the, the video and found it useful, please like it and thank you for watching.